Hi guys, it's me, Teacher Gorn. In our today's video, we will talk about converting units of length. So without further ado, let's do this topic. The fundamental unit of length in metric system is the meter. So again, it is, meter is considered as the center of metric system when it comes to units of length. So we have here this given table, and at the upper part of the table, we have the unit, we have the symbol, we have the fraction or multiple of 1 meter. And then, ito yung mga basic unit na may encounter nyo. We have the millimeter. We're in, the symbol for millimeter is mm. And then, second unit na you will encounter is centimeter, which is represented by cm. The cimeter, represented by dm. Meter, basically, is represented by m. The cameter is dam. Hectometer is HM, and lastly, kilometer is KM. Meron pang iba't ibang klaseng units of length, pero ito, ito mga basic lang yung pinakita natin dito sa video natin. So, for this part naman, mag-focus tayo sa ating 1, which is yung ating meter. Sabi nga, diba, siya yung center. Kung mapapansin nyo, kung mapapansin nyo mga numbers ito, these are all multiples of 10. So, dito, from 1, kung tataas tayo dito, kung mapapansin nyo yung number natin, is lalong lumiliit. And then, from meter to kilometer, yung value ng meter, papunta sa decameter, hectometer, and kilometer, is lalong lumalaki by multiples of 10. So, for the next part of our video, tuturuan ko kayo mag, kung paano mag-convert ng specific unit to the other unit of length. Gamit yung ating metric converter. This is your metric converter. As you can see, arrange siya nasa gitna si meter and then papunta dito hanggang kay kilometer. So, dito naman sa kanan is from dm cm to millimeter. So, we have here to convert the following given examples. So, let's start with number one. We have two kilometer to be converted to meters. Sir, paano ba tayo nagmumultiply or paano ba tayo nagconvert ng kilometers to meter? So, focus kayo dito sa ating metric converter. So, you have two kilometers, right? So, ngayon, we need to convert two kilometers to meter. So, dito tayo mag-start. Sa ating metric system, mag-start tayo dito sa ating kilometer. Sa kilometer natin. So, starting from the kilometer, Bibilangin natin ilang units ang, pup ang pupuntahan natin or lalakbayin natin papunta kay meter. So, from kilometer, 1, 2, and 3. Again, bilangin ulit natin kung ilang units meron tayo from kilometer to meter. 1, 2, 3. At ang direction niyan is from left to right. Nakakuha ba? So, we have 3 units from left to right. So, dito, meron tayo ng decimal. Gagawin natin, mag-move tayo ng 1, 1, 2, 3 units. At yung mga spaces na to, itong mga spaces na to, ay lalagyan natin ng 0. 1, 2, and 3. Therefore, meron tayong 2,000 meters in 2 kilometers. Again, we have 2,000 meters in 2 kilometers. So, I hope na sa first example pa lang natin, you already know how to use the metric converter. Next, let's move on with item number 2. We need to convert 354 centimeters to meters. Again, convert 354 centimeters to meters. Kunin natin yung ating 354. So, since ang ating starting point is centimeter, Dito tayo mag-start sa centimeter. Centimeter. And then, bibilang tayo ng unit papunta kay meter. So, we need to count 1 and 2. Again, let me repeat. 1 and 2. At ang kanyang direction ay from right to left. So, dito mayroon tayo itong decimal point. Ang gagawin natin is mag-move tayo ng decimal point natin. 2 units. So, we have 1 and 2. So, it stops here. Therefore, the value or the amount of meter in 354 centimeters is none other than 3.54 
meters. We have 3.54 meters sa 354 centimeters. So let's move on with item number 3. You can pause for a while and convert 7.15 meters to centimeter. Okay? You can pause the video and you can do it yourself using this metric, system, metric converter. Okay? Pause the video. Okay, so we have 7.15. Again, 7.15. Using this, our starting point is meter. So, dito tayo mag-start. And then, ang target natin is to convert 7.15 meters to centimeter. So, we will count from meters 1 and 2. Again, let me repeat. 1 and 2 from left to right. Again, the direction is from left to right. So, from this point, mag-move tayo ng 1 and 2. Again, 1 and 2. Therefore, the correct answer for number 3 is that we have 715 centimeters in 7.15 meters. So, I hope na, for example, number 1, number 2, and number 3, you already know how to use the metric converter. Now, let's move on with item number 4. We have here 80 millimeters. 80 millimeters. 2 meters. So, ang starting point natin is for, from millimeters. Yan. We start with millimeters. And then, it will be converted sa meter. So, count tayo from millimeters. 1 unit. 2 unit. And 3 unit. And as you can see, ang movement natin is from right to left. From right to left. So, ang gagawin natin ngayon is that we have the 80 from right to left. Meron tayo decimal. pag number, ha? 1, 2, and 3. So, dito next stop. Lagyan natin ng 0 dito. Therefore, the value or the answer is none other than 0. Point zero 0. Pero pwede nyo na rin tanggalin yung 0 dito kasi siya yung 0. Okay? So, we have 0 0.08 meters in 80 millimeter. Okay? So, let's move on with item number 5 naman. For item number 5, we need to convert 275 decimeter Two meter. So we have 275 decimeters to meter. So dito tayo mag-start. Decimeter. So counting from decimeter papunta sa meter, meron tayong one unit. And then ang movement natin is from right to left. So mula dito sa decimal na to, one. Again, one unit. Therefore, the correct answer for number five is none other than 27.5 meters. So that's it for the first five examples that we have on how to convert unit of length using metric system. Now let's have the second part of this tutorial video wherein I will give you more examples to convert using the metric system or the metric converter. So for item number six, so I will be doing six and seven and 8 and 9 will serve as your assignment if you know or if you learn something from this tutorial video. So let's start with item number 6. We will convert 200, sorry, 2,650 meters to kilometers. So again, we need to convert 2,650 meters to kilometers, meaning we will start with meters. We will start with meters. And then our target here is to move from meters to kilometers. So we will count 1, 2, 3 units from right to left. Meaning from this decimal point, mag-move tayo ng 1, 2, and 3 from right to left. Therefore, the value or the value of kilometers in 2,650 meters 
is none other than 2.650 kilometers. Or you can simply erase this one and you can have 2.65 kilometers. That's it for item number 6. So let's move on with item number 7 as our last item for this tutorial video. We have... 0 0.09 meters to millimeters. So our starting point is meters. So start as a meters. Papunta sa millimeter. So we need to count 1, 2, and 3. From left to right. Yan ang movement natin. Meaning, from this point, we will count 1, 2, and 3 units. Maglalagay tayo dito ng 0. So if that is your answer, that is equivalent to 90. Tatanggalin nyo na to, tatanggalin nyo na to, and you have 90. So you have 90 millimeters as the equivalent of 0 0.09 meters. Okay? So I hope na for our first 7 examples in converting the lengths o unit of lengths, gamit yung ating metric converter, ay natutunan nyo kung paano ito, ito i-convert na mas madali. So... Sa mga nanonood ng video natin, I hope na masagutan nyo yung number 8 and number number 9 and number 10 para makita natin kung na-apply nyo ba o natutunan nyo ba kung paano mag-convert ng unit of length gamit ang metric converter. Again, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe at i-hit na rin yung bell button for you to be updated sa ating mga latest uploads. Again, I am Teacher Gon. Maraming maraming salamat. Bye-bye!